Well, look, it's, it's uh, the cliche. It's a honeymoon period, right? Whether it's a new, whatever it's a new How job. How long does that last? Yeah, well, <laughs> depends on the player and the coach, right? And I, I've been harping on the ability to get the lines of communication going, keeping them going, and to make sure that they're on the same page. And it looks like they're on the same hey, page here. Look, they're having Patrick's the autograph, taking a, taking the autograph out sign off. Here. Patrick <laughs> and Naomi are having the autograph sign off right here. But I, I just think it's really important that early on they set the dynamic of how the communication is going to go, okay? Because you have a short window there to figure out if and when you're going to get buy-in from the player. And if you don't, you better figure out real quickly how you're going to adjust because it's not always what you say. It's the way you say it, and the player's got to buy into it. And Patrick's been with a lot of great players. I'll be shocked if he can't figure out how to get Naomi on the same page. Page. Another great thing that they both have going for them is Naomi is used to sort of being in this elevated superstar status and Patrick has coached a lot of those players as you mentioned so nothing is going to be this familiar. Naomi understands you know what he has had success with players sort of of my on court and off court lifestyle and that makes a difference. There's a lot that goes into it. Appearances so forth you have to balance that with the mental being on the court and, uh, and, and just for the record Patch. I saw Paul when he was coaching. I used to push he, Roger he, and Pete out of the way, he, didn't he's I? He's got a, <laughs> Get out of the way, guys. a much Taylor. bigger line I, than Patrick I'm had not, over there. And okay, I'm not I saw gonna, that, But Paul. the good news is today, I'm not wrestling Mike Russell to get the autographs. <laughs> I'll let Mike take that. <laughs> yeah. I'm I not going to lose that battle. Michael can take those autographs. Uh, it was actually interesting, Paul, just quickly. Uh, she was talking, Naomi, about the fact that she was a little undecided about whether to take Patrick because he had kind of coached Serena uh, before. It was, a, it was kind of an interesting sort of mindset, one of her rivals. Yeah, it is, it is interesting. I wonder, was it because it was one of her rivals or was it because she was debating whether or not she wanted someone so high profile? You know, and, and, and I, I think you always want to try to diffuse pressure as much as you can, especially for players like that where the expectation is so high. But it was it made, made me scratch my head a little bit because she is of the uh, utmost upper echelon, is Naomi, so nothing should fear her. They're also both not afraid of the spotlight, a lot of eyeballs on them. Perhaps, in a way, all this added attention will get them to zero in and focus more. Maybe that could be an added switch that uh, could help Naomi. Yeah, a bit of a shrinking violet like yourself, Prakash, both of them, aren't they? You know, you, know, you, you sharp today, Pat. <laughs> <laughs> the man is sharp today.